This is the submission screen. It's the last page of our client's tax return. This is where we obtain our electronic signatures. We print the return. We make sure our preparer fees are accurate. We can mark the return complete and ready to transmit or mark the return ready for review. So the first thing we'll do on this screen is select the sign button. Now if you're using a signature pad or any touch screen enabled device at this point you could have the taxpayer take their finger and scribble on the screen, scribble on your phone, scribble on your tablet and sign it. If you're not using one of these devices you can have the taxpayer grab your mouse hold down the left mouse button and sign away. Click Save Signature and our return is now signed. So anything that we now print that has a signature space on it will also have the taxpayers signature. Now I'm gonna pop the print button here. Let's look at the 8879 beautifully signed. If we look at the tax return, beautifully signed. And if we look at the bank application, beautifully signed as well. We can now print these documents and be on our way. We can also mark the return complete which says that everything represented on the return is correct. We can select a referral agent if necessary. We can also track how this client heard about us and we can mark the return ready for review if we want to transmit them all later or if we want someone else to check this return for us. We can set a return tag. This helps us track items that we might be waiting on for this particular return. We can indicate that we're waiting on a W-2 or we're waiting on a 1099-R, a mortgage statement, any additional documents. Very easy to use and very logical as far as the screen layout. You set up these return tags from the main menu in the configuration part of the program. So I'm going to close this window. If we're done with this return and we have permission to transmit, then the Save and Transmit Return to IRS button will appear. If we don't have the ability to transmit or if we don't have the permissions to transmit, then we would just have the Save and Exit Return button. For this video, I'm going to select Save and Exit Return. This takes us back to our home screen and we can take care of the next client waiting in the lobby. Now hopefully that looks simple enough. That again was the submission screen where we capture the taxpayer signature and we do all of our signature document printing. Thanks for watching.